Hello, Drake here. First off, I haven't done one of these in a while, but I got a new toy from Hanji, and I actually did the custom Drake toy, the one that was posted a few times, and you could say it was stolen, but it's an open design, so anyone can use it. But I actually asked them if they could do clear vinyl, and they said yes, so I actually attempted to do that. Before I start, I got the box over there, and this I'm actually wearing my first I actually figured out that um, I call it TSA compliant tail because in the previous time, go through the airport, uh, the belt was made of metal. So I actually have a plastic belt, nylon, which actually is, will fit, and a tail that has no metal in it at all. It's actually all rubbery and cloth. So by definition, it's a TSA compliant tail. But that's a side little side note. So. I got the new toy, and they can actually print the way that they're explaining it to me. Not really explained it actually. I had to figure out from her that the reason why, if you look at the paint job, it looks kind of different on Hanji's because they don't seem to choose the color vinyl as much unless you specifically request it. For example, Jets actually used for the Drake toy black vinyl with the lighter colors printed on top because they're dye sublimation. They're essentially burned on top of the material. Um, I've seen some clear pool toys you'll see that actually is printed on the inside and you can say this is scratch resistance and stuff like that. But um, I know some manufacturers will make them in clear. So when I saw that I asked Tanja can you do clear and surprisingly they actually sent me a really nice catalog. Well something that I wish Jets could actually do now. They, 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 they got something on them. Look at that. A full catalog, Kanji. Congratulations, you actually got an arts department. Um, yes, I, it would be appreciated some of the pictures you posted on here. Pro well, yeah, they kind of copies, but hey, um, you're in business, so I guess that's a plus one for you. Um, ooh, look at there's my favorite dragon toys. But yeah, these are the clones and cute, cool stuff. But they actually show something that Jets does not do, which I had it bugged them about, beyond showing the accessories. And if you can see it, it's in high res. Um, they show the valve. So, yeah, you could actually get an electric blower. Cool. I think uh, Trigger might actually see this, that they do sell blowers. You might want to bug them for pricing, Trigger. They probably have some, but I don't know if they give you the best price. But they actually list all their valves. They don't list what type they are. We all know in the group of... Uh, people who choose our valves. I'm a fan of Boston valves because they're huge. I like big valves, small toys. People like small valves, big toys. <laughs> so they actually have other stuff you can get, tie downs, and I've actually asked quote a few times, but I don't really get much crawl on their tie downs. Um, uh, jets, like I said, they have a specific way of designing their product to put in quality, and I'm going to give them lots of credit for that. But Hanji is a new company, and beyond not speaking English well and having communication breakdown issues because they're China and I'm not, um, yes, uh, sale finished means sales done or something like that, but that's okay. I'm used to it. So, but they do show the page of all of their vinyl type. Which I thought was kind of interesting and because they also make air blown stuff you'll see that they're mesh materials in here but they don't actually I've been asking her to give me some I take pictures of this catalog and send it right to her and says cool yeah the catalog is there I mean they have things like Pantone colors because that was explained wasn't explained by Jets but I had learned it from one of my art designer that some companies will print on the Pantone colors so if you send them an artistic rendering, they can literally color grab like you do with Photoshop and then you get the color idea. And they'll get close to it within 5% unless they say, well, what do we do if the color doesn't support? And you'll, get, you'll kind of learn that when I actually did it in clear. I seen a toy that was done in clear a while back. By the way, they send you a piece of patch I have somewhere. I just put it away, but they sent a patch too that I was able to measure the thickness and it came out for what I requested was 0.3, it came out to 0.29, so I guess it's close to 0.3 millimeter. For those who actually are using a caliber, I have a picture of a caliber on Twitter that actually measured it, 
and it was actually the size. So let's see if I can. This is kind of impressive that they tie it up. And as always, they give you a nice sack to put it in, which is kind of generous because this might separate your toys from pinches and unwanted pinches and holes that form from traveling. So let's see. Let's see if we got a good. I think we have it big enough. Like it's wide enough. How many minutes? Let's see. Yeah, all right. I might have to pause this in a sec here if this takes too long. noticed when I was looking at this when I opened the box up is that unlike the previous toy the, the purple so printed, it, it may actually be printed on the inside because they may have actually welded some of the seams together and printed it on top. If you're familiar how dye sublimation printing works an example is PVC ID cards and stuff um, I don't know if I have any on the wall but I printed some of myself out but they're actually printed, um, well they're printed on the surface of mine, but because uh, it's white PVC, so you burn the image right on there with another film. And you get these really thin material that you have these, uh, at the printer itself has this head with thermal heads that shoot high temperature for each pixel, and it then melts the material into the uh, PVC at, at, at sort of a really quick burst. Um, and I believe it is temperature based because I have actually fixed one of those at work uh, a few years back before we stopped using that technology at all because we never actually really intended to print badges at the office. But someone asked about it and we did that. So this really smells like a uh, shower curtain right now. And boy, they actually tied it real tight. How the heck did they get these things? I have no clue. Uh, I might pause the video in just a sec to see if I can figure this out. Yeah, pause. Okay. Slight little delay there. Um, trying to find out if they did a double valve like they did in my last one. Maybe because I bought it on sale, they actually had a valve on the head. I've asked about that and it may have been one of the manufacturing oops. One person said they put the other valve, but there you go. Let's see how long.
does not fit the other hole. Hopefully this isn't very long and maybe maybe uh, I don't have much room for toys right now because I have lots of other toys in this room that take up space, but you can see it. There you go. scratch when it's folded so that's actually kind of notable I don't really like the way it was done internally not as well it was done the first time around but I guess clear vinyl might have its attributes with it attributes when they fold it really tight well there you go clear drake version 1 or 2, whatever you want, but it was an attempt to try the, the clear vinyl that none of the other guys would do. Oh wow, they actually did this time, the spikes is actually inverted, and kudos to that. Um, I'll admit, Hanji likes to practice on their customers, and I guess that's why the price keeps going up, up, and away on me. I mean, that wing's real tight.
this is why I actually stay with one and a half meter or smaller toys. I don't really like the giant toys. Finding room in my place here is tight. they did this time they actually did yeah they actually did the spikes inverted so you don't have so they must have done the spike welds first and then welded around it and you can still see that their seams aren't actually continuous roll they're actually stand, chop 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 down the line so but 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 you're getting a little better I really do like the inverted paint idea. I don't wasn't sure they were gonna do that. But yeah it is. It's actually painted. I guess it's one step before, so yep. Yep, yep, yep. Well, there you have it. Roar.